एवरी वन वेलकम और वेलकम बैक टू द अनदर व्लाग सो इन दिस व्लाग आई वुड बी शोइंग यू हाउ डिड आई प्रेप फॉर माई मैथमेटिक्स फाइनल एग्जाम्स ऑफ क्लास नाइन सो दिस वॉज द डे ऑफ संडे एंड इट वॉज सेकेंड ऑफ मार्च सो आई वोक अप अराउंड सेवन फोर्टी एंड फर्स्ट आई जस्ट मेड माई ब्रेड्स एंड देन आई वेंट ऑन क्लीनिंग माई बेड सो फर्स्ट आई जस्ट फोल्डेड माई ब्लैंकेट एंड लाइक Uh, then I also cleaned the bed, and after that I just came to my study table, which was just full of books. So I just kept all the books at their places and rearranged them according to their places. And there were many of the books on my study table which are no longer used for me, such as NCERTs of class nine, whose exams I have already given. Then I just changed my cal uh, table calendars months, and I just changed it from February to March. And then I finally sit down around nine o'clock to study. So here I was like uh, doing all the important questions of each chapter. So I do have some extra books with me, but I find it quite. like time waste for me for searching the best question so it's like quite better if you go on google or internet and then you search for important questions there so i was just solving all of them hi so let me update you with all the things that i did till now so i started studying maths or practicing around 9 o'clock yes and then it is currently 12:30 and by the time i have done the number system statistics heron's formula and surface area volume these four chapter i am done with all the important questions uh, like which i found on the internet so i have done that all and most of my time went into that surface area volume chapter and i also had my breakfast in between that that i, that I didn't record so yeah, this is what the all the things that i have did and my further plan is that Uh, now I may take a bath, and then I have to complete all the important questions of all chapters that I found in my uh, extra books or something. And then I would be doing uh, the most expected series by next toppers because literally that is like exam savior. Okay. Now then, uh, I'm also trying that uh, I may do some questions in the NCERT which I have circled because I think that. they have the highest probability of coming according to me so i have to do that too so yeah this is all the plans and let's see okay so i'm thinking that first uh, let's go and have a shower then i would be also like opening my hairs opening my braids i've been making this for almost 2 days so i would be opening them and make it to one pony and then let's see what we do the next so by 2:30 pm i had my lunch as well as i also took a shower after that till 4 o'clock i just took some rest and slept for a while and then around 5 o'clock i finally sat down for doing this expected questions and like um, these were mostly from ncerts because questions are generally picked up from ncerts only in mathematics and most of you ask me whether you do rs or rd see rs and rd books are used for making your concept better but while you're preparing for exams or exams are near then just go through your ncert because most of the questions will come from ncert only because they have a very different varieties of questions within themselves hi everyone so it's currently 10 pm and i am done with shobhit bhaiya's most expected question series and i have also done mcqs of few chapters because mcqs are the most vulnerable to uh, like getting uh, wrongs so that's why it's important to practice mcq as well competency based mcqs and now i am thinking to just revise and go through the theoretical chapters of mathematics such as postulates axioms and uh, some definitions which will which may come in an exam so i am going to read that as well as i am just going to look through over all the theorems by chance if it come in an exam such as sss a uh, asa sas uh, like all the theorems whichever are there so i have i will also go through it midpoint theorem and every theorem so yeah now this is my plan and i think it may go up to 1 or 2 am but now i am in habit of that waking up till then uh, because of my exam so yeah i am very habitual to that now 
so few days back i was talking to one of my friend who uh, who was in my class only but she jumped one class so now she is giving her 10th board and she told me how she used to wake up till 2 or 3 pm uh, in the morning to study for exams and then she would go to sleep at 4 and then wake up at 8 uh, and then go for her exam so yeah this is now exactly happening with me do let me know if this also like happening with you so here are all the questions which were provided by shobhit bhaiya so i have written in quite a systematic way in which i would be writing my ultimate answer sheet so this is how i have written and i do have skipped few of the question because i have already practiced them multiple times so i don't think that repeating the same question will give me any benefit so that's why so this is how i have done and the previous questions this is how I have done all the questions. So yeah, this is what all I have done. Then around eleven uh, thirty, I again started doing all the theorems. So here I was watching a video lecture in which like all the theorems of class nine was covered. So I was going through that, and I was also practicing side by side.